you're ready to see Jack, your friend Jack came to see you. Yeah, you can play a toy with him. Oh, you don't even know. Do you hear Jack? Shanna's seeing Jack. She missed him. You're going to see Jack in a minute, your best friend. You're going to see your best friend. How do you feel? Shanna's dad is here, brought Jack down, Shanna's service dog. Her parents watched her service dog while she was here. So Jack and Benny are out playing. I'm not sure how much they're playing. They're kind of running next to each other. We thought they would immediately start wrestling, but it's been a year and two months since they've seen each other. So very happy. My heart is full. Maybe it's like wrestling is more intimate. I don't know. Like maybe it would take them a few minutes. Do I need to throw some balls over there? Yeah, maybe. He just likes to get other people's balls, see? There we go. Good boy, Jack. And Jack won't jump. <laughs> He's gonna go around. He dropped it. He dropped it. He wants Benny's ball. Silly dilly. <laughs> And he comes up it too. Yep. Good boy. Good boy. My boy, huh? Yeah. Oh. 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 Are you trying to give me the ball? Huh? Slide it off. We put the uh, other dogs in the, my closet where their crates are. Ready? Jack is quick, Benny. You gotta be quick. Bring. Bring the ball. Get him, Benny. See, that wasn't nice. What are we doing, boys? Somebody get the ball. I know if I get halfway down there, you'll run and get it. <laughs> Gosh, look how much bigger Jack is. It's like a daredevil here. Uh, what do you call it? Chicken? Playing chicken? <laughs> <laughs> Jack has grown so much since the last time they were together. Mm -hmm. He didn't used to be that much bigger.
Oh god, vertigo is just sitting up his heart and I'm feeling icky. Oh my, oh my, oh my days. Life is wonderful. Life is wonderful. Never understood. But life can be this Hi, baby girl. Good dog. You did a good job, honey. Good job. Good hi. Uh uh uh. We can't jump on Kelly. That's ouchie. I will miss you. Yes, he says, I will miss you too. I will miss you. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh, yeah. He's wagging his tail. Oh, yeah. I loved oh, you so oh, much. Yeah. Benny, your your slumber buddy's gonna be going. Oh I miss you. Yeah. Oh scratches. Dashy. Oh, she just walked a few a little close to you. Oh, I can miss you. And you yeah, you're my buddy. Yes. She's sniffing you, that's awesome. Oh, man. That was her goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, Benz. I love you so much. Good job. 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 I guess she's not happy that we had another dog and man in our house. They're like, wait, where did she go? Did you have fun playing with your best friend? Did you? And Aunt Shanna, you love Aunt Shanna. Oh, we have to tell Dashie it's okay. We were all a bit discombobulated for a bit, but everybody's on the bed now. This is Shanna's spot and Gibbs loves Shanna so much. So he is in her spot. He's going to keep it warm for her until she comes back. Jojo's also laying there. I wish that we lived closer together. I really wish we did, but we don't. And we got a few days and last night, it was amazing. My vertigo was better for a while and we just got to lay here and talk. The appreciation is big. She took care of five dogs and me and she didn't have her service dog why Benny slept with her and stayed with her the entire time. It was important to me that he was doing for her and that she was not alone at night. It was such a sacrifice for her to be away from her dog. It was such a sacrifice for her to do all of the stuff that she did. And seriously, like, I'm, I, 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 it's hard because I know that it's, taken a toll on her. I mean, I don't know what toll it's taken, but I know it will. You know, those of us with chronic illness, you know, we can't do anything without it kicking our butt. I think that's the best type of friendship is being able to trust and learn and grow with somebody. I'm crying because I'm happy and I'm thankful. I'm also crying because I'm sad. I'm gonna miss her. I think the biggest thing I'm having to learn is how to let people help me. I think it's just I'd rather be the person that's helping, you know? Like at one point, Shanna said to me, you're fiercely independent and you're also really stubborn. One of my coping mechanisms is denial of what the reality is so that I can actually exist in the reality. And so to be able to let somebody help you, you have to actually look at the fact that you need help. And that's hard. It's hard to look at how... Things really are. Who wants to look at the fact that they are really in such a bad place? And I have been 17 and a half years. So I learned, and it was hard for me, and I know it was hard for Shanna too, because <laughs> I think it was maddening to her. I grew, I grew. And at one point she said, can I make you, you know, chicken and vegetables for when I'm gone? 
and Kelly from a couple days ago would have said, no, I don't want you to do that. But the Kelly that is learning said, thank you. That would be really helpful. If she couldn't do it, she wouldn't offer it. I realized that's her offering me a gift, not me hurting her. I'm worn out now. I'm feeling it and everybody's exhausted. Or segregated. <laughs> this is so funny. I'm hurting and I need to... You can see bruising down here. I had to lay down because I'm starting to get spinny. Life is wonderful. What was that? What are you worrying about? What are you going to say? Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. You have so much energy, nut. <laughs> Shanna, thank you to her mom and dad. Thank you for watching Jack and for her dad for bringing her here and taking her home. I mean, he's driving over six hours today. Like, it's like that's a gift to me. It is amazing to be loved like this. Friendships are where it's at. You are not. Alone in this world, you are not alone. You are not alone in this world, you 